it's Jeff. This is uh, update number four of my uh, British Lorry 3-ton LGOC B-Type for Mini Art. This is also for the uh, Big Rig Group Build hosted by Jeff's Model Garage. Uh, kit number 38027, 135th scale. Um, making some progress this time. I'll show you guys where I'm at. Um, I think if you remember correctly, or if I remember correctly, this is the one we're going for. Okay. Black frame, yellow, black, uh, black hood, and uh, yellow fenders. So here's where we're at. Okay. Got the yellow on. I still got to do the fender, so a little more yellow. This is um, uh, Vallejo Model Air 71087 yellow. Okay, I went through almost a whole bottle doing that. Going over the black primer maybe wasn't the best idea. But anyway, it looks pretty good, I think. Got the uh, tires painted in the rubber black. Or I should say it's it's dark rubber. Panzer Aces 306. And uh, I painted the wheels in the... Um, German red brown. It called for red brown, but uh, that's what I had. So that's that's where we're at now. The frame is black. The radiator is aluminum. Uh, in the actual drawing, it shows the radiator core being uh, aluminum too. But I went ahead and did it black just for a little little uh, change. There's our crank. That's how the thing was started. No, uh, no fancy, you know, electric starts or anything on this. Um, the body's just sitting on there and the tires and stuff. The wheels are all just sitting on there right now. But uh, I'll give this a little time to, to uh, dry good. And then I'll um, give it some clear. And uh, then we'll start with the decals. This, this body or this uh, bed fits really tight. Um... It, it fits great, but you just got to kind of work with it to get it to all set right. Uh, I made one small error when I was earlier. Um, I put the engine all together. Not thinking about it, I should have paid more attention to the instructions, but the engine doesn't set down in the frame like modern engines do. It comes up from the bottom. And it's pretty tight fit, so I actually had to take the water inlet and outlet loose and uh, get the engine in there and then put them back on. I've still got to get the uh, exhaust manifold on there, but that's no big deal. But uh, just be, you know, give you a heads up, you know, don't go as far as I did putting the engine together because it won't fit. Uh, you got to kind of put it in there in pieces. But I think it looks pretty good. So it won't be long. We'll be doing some uh, decals. And uh, I've got to mask this off. These pieces of iron on here are all supposed to be in black. So I'll in across the back here too. And then I've got the glass to put in. There's a seat that goes in there that I've got to paint. And then there's some controls. And I've got to get the hood all fit just right. But uh, it's moving right along. Just thought I'd show you guys where I was at. I uh, hope everything's going good for you guys. I'm at uh, 175 now, so it won't be too long. We'll be at 200. So if you haven't subscribed yet and you like the content, please, please hit the subscribe button. It'll help me out a lot. And uh, I'll be back before you know it with another update. You guys have a great day, okay? Bye-bye.